Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to disable reserve storage on Windows 10. So, reserve storage is Microsoft's attempt to prevent users from using up too much drive space on their computer, so it's saving it for potential Windows updates in the future. So while the Microsoft development team has release information that it can still use other storage space on your computer for Windows updates even if the reserved storage is filled to capacity. I'm going to show you guys how to modify that size of the system reserved. So we're going to start by opening up the SAR menu. Type in settings. Best match to go back with settings right above app. So go ahead and left click on that. Select the system tile. Select storage on the left side. And now you want to select where it says Show More Categories. You want to locate the System and Reserved. Let's go ahead and left click on that. So if you want to turn this off and free up this amount of space, I'm going to show you guys how to do it. And you're going to open up the Star menu, type in RegEdit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Press match to go back to Registry Editor. You want to right click on that and then left click on Run as Administrator. If you receive a User Account Control Prompt, go ahead and left click on Yes. Now, before you proceed in the registry, I would highly suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything went wrong, you could easily restore it back. And in order to create the backup, it's very simple. Just go ahead and left click on the File tab. Select Export. For file name, I would suggest naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Export range should be selected to All, and then save it to a convenient location on your computer. And if you ever need to import it back in, you just go left click on File, and then select Import. So pretty straightforward process of how to do that. And now we're ready to begin. So double click on the HK Local Machine folder. Do the same thing now for the software folder. Same thing for Microsoft. Locate the Windows folder. So scroll down a little bit. Expand that. Do the same thing for current version. So expand that one as well. And now it should be something that says Reserve Manager in here. So scroll down a little bit. right here. So now you want to go double click on the D word value on the right side that says shipped with reserves. So I can make it a little wider here so you can see it. Double click on that. So if you want to disable reserved storage you want to set this to zero. If you want to enable reserved storage you want to set it to one. So if you want to enable it change it to one. If you want to disable it change it to zero. And then just go left click on OK. And that's pretty much it, guys. So, pretty straightforward process here. Do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.